Hi, Ross here, your expert at all things moving. You might probably think that out of all the rooms in the house, bathroom is pretty much the easiest to deal with because it's the smallest and has the least items. But most people do not realize the complexity and the amount of items they store in their bathrooms before it comes to the moving stage. So today we're going to talk about a couple of categories of things you might find in your bathroom, the way to pack them, and tips on how to efficiently relocate and avoid any damage. Let's go! Moving tips. Category number one, Madison. Make sure that you first start sorting through all of your bathroom cabinets looking for any medicine bottles, pills and jars. Remember to thoroughly analyze them and divide them into those that you will be taking with yourself and those you will need to toss away. Remember, the medicine should not be used if the expiry date is over. The label is not clearly seen or cannot be distinguished or read. There is no label at all. The qualities such as color and taste of the pills or medicine have changed with time. The medicine causes side effects that didn't occur before. Or the medication was stopped or discontinued. If some of the medicine needs to be disposed of, do not flush it down the toilet. Some pills cause environmental damage to surroundings. So, before doing so, please consult with your local pharmacist or the FDA. Category number two, toiletries. Make sure to sort out through your toiletries and find out what you will need to take with yourself and what you will need to toss away. Probably expensive hair products, shampoos and conditioners should be put on that list. Remember, things such as shampoos, conditioners and etc are usually a subject to leaking. So make sure to put each individual bottle in a zippered plastic bag to avoid damage to anything else in the box. As for not needed items, make sure to donate them. Some women shelters usually accept fresh creams, shampoos and hair products. Moving tips. Category number three, packing. When it comes to packing bathroom items, as I've mentioned in a previous category, make sure that you tackle this task responsibly. Put all the containers in zippered plastic bags to make sure that they won't spill and damage anything else in the box. And a very useful advice would be to pack those items into small little separate boxes and then packing those boxes in a medium or medium to large box. Remember, don't pack those things too heavily. And category number four, packing materials. In here, we're not really differentiating it from other rooms. You'll need all the needed packing supplies that you use for your living room, your bedroom, or your kitchen for that matter, including packing tape, bubble wrap, wrapping paper, and of course, boxes to pack it all in. Additionally, as I've already mentioned, you will need zippered plastic bags because those will help you out in preventing shampoo bottles or whatnot from spilling out and damaging. In conclusion, moving your bathroom is not as hard as I just made it look like. It is very easy if you follow simple tips, keep everything organized and do it step by step. Good luck with your bathroom move. Moving tips.